which is one of the nice things about the LCM. It, it's not rigid. It's not rigid. You can often make it to your own requirements. You can tailor it to you and your pupils. Um, I think that's a good thing. Right? Um, so, can, can I so can I just confirm? That means LCM National Play has never been agreed. No. Because when we signed up, we were told, I, I don't know how, but we got the idea that it is a they, they went for it. They went for they it. Apply. Like, oh. Yes, they did apply. They apply every time. They're always applying. Because everything, what, what is in this syllabus now, this is the newest one. This is until 2011, the piano, ordinary piano repertoire list syllabus list. This is um, the latest. And this has to go before the powers that be to be accredited. So every time they change a the syllabus, which is why they don't tend to do it too often, because it all has to go before the government every time, and they have to tick every grade and put it and see what's going on. So when they first brought in the leisure play, as far as they were concerned, they, were gonna, they put them through for accreditation. And as far as they knew, that was going to happen. But of course, the powers that be, for various reasons, decided that wasn't going to be the case. But they still applied. Do you remember when, when the leisure play started? What year? Oof. I mean, you now you're asking me, but it's been going quite a long time. I think, actually, hang on, I can tell you when it wasn't going, I think. But I just happen to have my great favourite look at this. It's not my oldest one by any means. I've got one syllabus from the days before we went decimal in money, in old imperial money. Um, right, let's have a look at this one. It's in on this one, so it was in 2001. So I'd say it's probably been going since this one came out. Say about 2000, about 10 years. And they keep applying, and they have changed it quite a lot over the years. What, what can be played and what they would expect to hear. But rest assured, as far as the examiners are concerned, we are marking at that level of the corresponding grade. Would you want to know what that is? If you want to take this down, you can, or if not, I'll tell you again later. The preliminary is grade one, standard. The elementary is grade two. Transitional is three. Pre-intermediate is four. Intermediate is five. Upper intermediate is six. Advanced is seven and proficiency is eight. Whatever one we are marking, we are marking at that standard. Nothing is less. No matter what you play, no matter what you play, if someone comes in and plays to me some heavy rock, I'm still going to mark that at a grade eight standard. If they don't give me, produce me the grade eight standard on that heavy rock, I'm not going to mark, I'm not going to let it go. All right, it's, it's that clear cut, and at that standard, we, we do expect it high. So, can, can our students to say this batch, those that did the transitional, mm -hmm. can they say that I have a grade three? Not, no, you can't say you have a grade three, but you can say that you have grade three equivalent in performance. In performance, absolutely, and that is absolutely correct. No one can doubt you on any level. You are grade three, grade five, grade eight level in piano performance or singing performance or violin performance. It's across the board. Can we, if we were to uh, gear, up, gear up our students yes. to go up to proficiency brigade in the should be, yes. and then train them in theory yes. up to grade 5 yep. and then they can sit for a diploma. They can apply to go for a diploma. Am I right to say that? I will check that for you because I've got a brand new syllabus because I'm going to have to do a workshop on the diplomas. When is it? Uh, I can tell you that if anybody's interested. It's going to be on the diplomas. Um, right. Uh, here we go. Oh, it's on. It's tomorrow. I'm 
doing a workshop at Kuala Lumpur 3. Do you know where that's held? That's with Shirley Go. Mm -hmm. Shirley Go? Shirley yeah. Go? Yes, Cadenza Music Academy. Cadenza. Yeah, I've got your dress here. That's the address. Can you get, do you want to get this copied? It's my timetable, but you're more than welcome to get it copied. And then if you want to get some copies, we'll um, sort that out. Because so I'm giving a, a talk on the, um, the new piano list, which is hot off the press, 2015, and the new um, performance and teaching components, if anybody's interested. That's going to be tomorrow. And these are going to be held. No, it's going to be held. It's going to be at Cadenza Music Academy. Which is in Bandar Baru. I don't know. Yes. Oh, yes, quite likely, yes. Um, so if anybody's is interested. It can, can you call? I, think, I, don't, I don't think it costs anything, but I think, you know, I don't know. But yeah, yeah, it'd be a yeah, phone number. They'd give a ring tonight. You know, I mean, they, they'd be more, they're more than happy to have people there because obviously, you know, it gives you an insight into what's going on. Um, and I've made, uh, there are some differences on these, and I have studied them before I came out so that I know. But these are 2011 to 2015, literally that hot off the press. And um, tells you the diploma route here. Okay, yeah, I'll do this when he comes back. Is there anybody want to ask anything in the meantime <laughs> on, on anything so far? You happy on how it's going so far? Because I'll get on to the different styles of music that we would like to hear on leisure play. Because in order that, as far as I'm concerned, it's very easy to turn around to people to turn around and say, "Oh, but that's not a grade eight. Yeah. Oh, that I've got grade eight. That's different than what you've got. Yours is easier than mine. So the way you combat that is in the music that they play." Because it doesn't matter how many times you say some art, but it's marked the same. They say, no, it's not, because you only play four pieces. <laughs> I have to do scales, I have to do this, I have to do that. <laughs> and not every board, and the AB in particular, still demand scales on all their plates. And they won't change. No matter if the roof fell in on the academy, they will not change. All right? They are very, very strict, very watertight. And, um, but that's all to do with money. I know, because I know some of you work there. <laughs> <laughs> and then I was asked to go and be an examiner there about eight, nine, ten years ago.